Hi, I'm Mira. Welcome to Flow with Mira. I named this class Intermediate Athletic Med class. The name says it's all. It's going to be challenging. I'll be doing some traditional intermediate uh, exercises with a little bit of twist. So make sure you are comfortable in your intermediate traditional Pilates exercises before you join this class. So let's go ahead and start the class. We are going to start standing. So go ahead and find the center of your mat and have your feet parallel position. We'll start the class with some standing roll down and then we'll do some squat. So arms long by the side, find your tallest, longest position. Take an in breath. Exhale, let's go ahead and roll the spine down. We'll start from the tip of the head and the neck, the upper back, the middle back, lifting the lower back high before you fold the hip forward, bringing your body closer to the floor. We inhale at the bottom. Now, as we exhale, go ahead and lift the abdominal up and start curling the pelvis under and stack the lower spine, middle spine, top of spine, shoulders stacking above and the neck head floating. Let's do that again in breath. Exhale, we roll down. Take this moment to just scan your body. How is your body feeling today? Fold the hip forward, soften the knees if you need to, if you're feeling a little stiff this morning or afternoon or evening, in breath. Exhale, roll it up. It's morning for me here, so that's why I said the morning. And all the way up to standing nice and tall, opening across the front of your chest. One more time. Exhale, we roll down. Continue to scan the body. Acknowledge. How is it feeling today? Appreciate it. And in breath. Exhale. Rolling back. And lifting up. And tall. Moving on to our squat. We inhale. Send the knees forward. Send the pelvis back and your arms next to your ears. Exhale. We'll lift. Inhale, making sure your knees are in parallel position over your toes. Exhale. So we're doing a diagonal position here, diagonal squat. Exhale. Two more. In breath. Gaze is forward, down to the floor. Last one. In breath. We stay here. Little pulses for me, please. We exhale, double breath. We go up, up. Inhale. Exhale. In breath, exhale, inhale, three more set, inhale, two more set, inhale, last set, inhale, we stay down, now lift the heels up and lower the heels and we lift and lower, relevate the heels up and lower. Three more. Hold that center. Last two. Last one. We stay up. Little pulses again. Exhale. Shh. Shh. Inhale. Exhale. Shh. Shh. Heel stay up. Exhale. Shh. Shh. Inhale. Three more. Shh. Shh. In breath. Two. Shh. Shh. Inhale. Last. Shh. Shh. Inhale. Lower the heels down, straighten the legs and lift the spine tall. Shake the legs a little bit and come. We have our feet wider than the pelvis, wider than the shoulder. Whoop, lost my balance. Take your arms out to the side here. Standing nice and tall, we're going to transfer the pelvis to your left. So we go over, right half the thigh over your foot. Come back, center and over to your right and exhale inhale keep the external rotation at the hip joint as you transfer the pelvis we bend and extend the little side lunges here exhale in breath exhale and move the pelvis and the trunk together and and move the pelvis and the trunk together now let's go over here now what we're going to do is forward fold at the hip joint bring your arms 
next to your ears. And bring the body upright. Coming up. Other side. Over. Forward fold. At the hips. And upright through the spine. Come back to center. Again. Side. Forward fold. And upright. Center. And side. Forward fold. And upright. Center, last set, side, forward fold, upright, center, last one, side, forward fold, and upright, center, and walk your feet back underneath your hips. Let's go down to the mat. So we are going to start with a roll up in a reverse way because we're starting sitting up tall. So have your legs together. Take your arms forward in front of you, rounding the back, pulling back in the abdominal, reaching forward so you feel the stretch in your spine here. Into your C curve position, active arm. We exhale, we roll back, get the sacrum down, lower spine down, the arms are aligned with the shoulders, arms overhead. Inhale, into a chest lift high. Take your arms by the side. Now here, pause for a moment. Pull in the center, pull in your belly. Curl the pelvis a little bit more. Then use that hip flexors to come up to a C-curve position. In breath. Exhale. We roll back. Sacrum on the floor. Lower back on the floor. Then take your arms overhead. And inhale, we'll lift. Exhale, we fall up and over from the hip joint into that C curve. Again, one more. Exhale, we roll back, 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 arms, overhead. Inhale, lift, imprint your lower spine, then fall up from the hip joint into that C curve. Now we stay. Lift your right leg off the floor. And then we roll back again. And take your arms overhead and keep that leg floating. We inhale, come up to your chest lift. Exhale, we go up and over into that C curve again. Lower the leg, lift the left leg up. Keep the leg reaching away. Then we roll back, take care of the pelvis, make sure that it's still square. And arms overhead, inhale, lift up and over. Exhale, come up over the legs and lower, switch right leg up and roll back, arms overhead, inhale, lift up and over, exhale, continue up into that C curve and come on down, last one, lift it up and rolling back, arms overhead, and inhale, lift, exhale, up and over. And we take the leg down. Keep the legs down on the floor. Then we're going to transition ourselves down to the floor. And we roll back just to the chest lift position here. Bring the knees in, drag the legs, take it up to tabletop, palms facing down for the hundreds. We extend the legs away. Inhale, lift up a little higher. Exhale, we pump. And inhale, three, four, five. Keep the energy of the legs reaching forward as well with your arm. We exhale, we deepen the abdominal. We inhale, see if you can lift up a little higher. Exhale, sh, 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 and in breath. Make sure your lower back is resting on the floor. And in breath. And three more times. Two. Last. Stay. Bend the knees in. Drag it, drag it, drag it. Lower one foot. Second one down. Arms long by the side. Release the head down. Readjust the position. We're going to do our pelvic curl here. Make sure your feet are parallel. Take an in breath. Anchor the feet down. And we exhale. We curl up. 
pressing the feet down, lifting with the hamstrings, abs is working, and finish up the pelvis with the glutes. Press your arms down, lift the chest a little higher without losing the abdominal connection. Then we exhale, we roll down, vertebra by vertebra, imprinting down to the floor, and we come back to your start position. Again, we exhale. Really trying to make this articulation really smooth, feeling the peeling off of each vertebra one at a time. And then at the end, really press the arms down, activate the arms muscle, lift up a little higher. Then you exhale, we roll down. As you go down, lengthen the neck away from the shoulder. And allow the spine to unravel itself back to your start position. Next one, we stay up. Exhale, we roll up. Curling up, abs working, abs working, hamstrings are burning, glutes are firing, ready, and then we stay. Lift the right leg up to a tabletop. Then we roll down for the single leg pelvic curl. And exhale, we roll up, press the feet, lift up in breath. Exhale, we roll down. Again, two more. Exhale. We roll up and down. One more, last one. And roll up, hold, lower the foot down. Reestablish the pelvis position. Then we transfer the weight and take the other leg up. We roll down. In breath, exhale, press down to lift up. In breath. Exhale, roll down. Again, exhale, roll up. And breath, roll down. Next one, we stay up. And exhale, roll up, hold. Lower the foot down, reestablish the pelvis position. Take the other leg up again, which is my right leg. And then we extend it up straight up to the sky. We lower shoulder bridge, inhale, flex, exhale, inhale, flex, and three, two, one. We stay, we point, we lower just a tiny bit and lift it up, little hip lifts, up, up, three more. Keep those arms active, two, last, we hold, Bend the knee, take the foot down, reestablish the pelvis position. Then we got the other leg. Do not go down just yet. Straighten the leg up. And we go down. Inhale, kick. Inhale, kick. Exhale. Exhale. Three more. Pelvis is stable. Hopefully for you. Last one. Stay up. We point. A little lower. Curl up. Hip lift. Two. Three. Three more. Two, one, hold, bend the knee, foot comes down, reestablish your pelvis, then we articulate down, 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 we straighten the legs out again, we're going to do some roll up, oh, one roll up actually, legs together, ribs lengthening down, inhaling to lift, exhale, up, into that C curve. All right, bend the knees onto our rolling like a ball. Now, a little twist in our rolling like a ball. We're going to attempt to do some squat. So, this is what we're going to do. So, let's establish your our rolling like a ball position first. We balance gracefully and then we keep our arms active. Your feet are off the floor really hollow the abdominal. Then we roll back. As you come forward, place your feet down, separate them, and we're gonna do a little squat, a little off the floor. Then we sit down, legs together, balance, we roll back. And then we come back, feet apart, little squat. And we sit down and roll back, apart, little squat. And then down, as I go to my little squat, I separate my feet apart and lift. I'm gonna use my glute, my hip extensors to come up, down. And I did say this is athletic net, so 
and down. Bring your heart rate up a little bit here, and at least mine, up, and down. Two more, and press down, left, and down. Last one, make sure your feet are parallel and neat here, and up, and down, and we roll. Come to a balance, we stay. How did you go? <laughs> right, have your feet down. Move back a tiny bit. Arms forward. Let's roll back. We've got double leg stretch, single leg stretch, and crisscross. Then we pull away. Go to your chest lift position. Bring the legs up, tabletop, hands on knees, and bring the knees slightly closer to your forehead, and then lift the chest a little higher too, so your arms are working here. Double leg stretch, we inhale. Shoot the arms and legs away like a boomerang. Arms to the side, drag the legs in. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, two more. Reach up, and then we're gonna do a little bit of a variation. And the next one, we stay. Hold in a boomerang position. In external, rotate the legs, and we cross, 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 cross. Two more set. Last set. Stay parallel, bring it in. Lift the chest a little higher, single leg stretch, extend your left leg forward, right knee with you, hands on the right knee, lift the chest. Make sure your feet are at the same height, double check that. And we switch, and we switch, and we switch. Maintain the abdominal contraction at all time, and, and let's transfer our hands behind the head. And support your head like a hammock here. Exhale. Exhale. Two more sets. Last set. We hold. I got my right knee towards me. Crisscross over. And other way. And and other way. Three. Two. Last, hold the last one, straighten the arms forward, little pulses, four, five, four, three, two, one, hold, grab the back of your thigh, come up a little higher, now maintain that new height, do not drop down on me, take your hand behind your head, Ooh, a lot of work, switch, arm, and two, Three, four, five, hold, grab the back of your thigh, lift up higher. Oh, I need to adjust my leg because it's dropping. Lift up higher in rotation, maintain that new height. Hands behind your head, back to center, legs together, arms long by the side, head rest down. Okay, let's go to the rollover. We extend. 90. Then curl the pelvis, press the arms down, bring the legs over your face, power to the ground, dorsiflex, separate, lower down. We roll back down. Keep the thighs close to your chest here. Anchor the pelvis, point your feet, reach out together and up. Roll over, pressing down with the arms as you lift the pelvis up, flex. Separate, we lower, we roll down. Bottoms anchored, point the feet, legs away. Together, two more, up. And active arm, bring the legs over. Flex, separate, lower. Then roll the spine down. Your arms needs to be active here and keep the thighs close to your chest. Anchor the pelvis. Point the feet, lengthen the legs away. Together, last one, up. And roll over. And we flex, separate. We lower the legs. We roll back. All right, 
pointing the feet, reaching out together, have the legs up, hold it up there for the corkscrew. Let's go to me first and then away. Center, over to you, exhale away. Center, and to me, exhale away. Center, anchor the shoulders down, over to you. Exhale away. Center, and last set, and away. Center, last one, and away. Back, we bend the knees, we lower one, we lower two. Walk your foot a little bit further away from the pelvis. Lift your head and chest up. Readjust the pelvis if you need to. And let's go deep, deep and come up to the C curve. And we lift the spine up. We extend the legs. We've got our back support. We got our little, I forgot, deflope. Here we go. So press down as we lift the chest up. Half your feet slightly apart there. When you're ready, let's go. Lift up. Neck is long aligned with the spine, folding through the hip joint, just touching and then we rebound. Imagine the floor is lava. So we're not going to sit down. We're just gonna go, oh, that's hot and come back up again. And we go down and bounce it up again. We go down, last one, we stay. Now, let's have your left leg up. Bend, kick, lower. Bend, kick, lower. Three, lower. Two, one, stay. Other side. Bend, kick, lower. Two, lower. Three, Lower, four, lower, five, lower. Now, take your left knee up, tabletop. We're gonna spin our body over to our right side, spin the hand. You got that? So we're going to lunge position here, and then we're gonna come up, arms next to your ears. Now we're gonna transfer the weight to the front leg, lift the back leg up, balance, lower, lift. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold, lower, transfer the hand back, and then we're going to spin the hand, rotate yourself back. Come down, lower. You got that? We're gonna do the other side. Okay, we're gonna come up again, lift. Knee bend, rotate, foot down. You're in a lunge, just spin the bottom hand and then take the arm, ears. Transfer the weight to the front leg and we lift. 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one, down, hand comes down, and we rotate, boom, leg up, I'm a mess, <laughs> come down, and readjust yourself. Awesome, turn yourself, face me for the side kick. We have our triangle, Position here, elbows down, lifting up, hands there. Here we go, forward kick. Inhale, and three, two, one. Stay back, we take the leg down, bring the forearm down, dorsiflex the feet for the side bridge. We press down, we lift. And down. And lift. And down. Three more. Lift. And down. Two more. 
Last one, we stay up and turn the palms facing me, rotate to the back and open and rotate. Just the sort of the upper body here, rotate and back and come on down. All right, spin your leg over to the other side, onto the elbow, side kick, and then we'll go into side bridge and we'll lift, flex, we go. Two more. Last one, reach back, we lower, dorsiflex, forearm down, arm is long, and we lift. And we go. And we lift. And we go. And three more lift. Two more lift. Last one, we stay up and turn the palms forward and rotate. Loop the arm through. Open. Rotate. Open. One more. Rotate. Open. We go down. Onto the front. All right. Arms are straight. Legs are straight. Our favorite swimming. Okay, straighten arms, legs, and pick up the abdominal, lift the arms and the legs up, right arm, left leg, left arm, right leg, and we go, bum, 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 exhale for five, inhale, and inhale, three more set, two, Last. Straight and long, off the floor, then we come down. All right, bring those legs together. Bring the legs off, lift the back up, open the arms, grab the ankles for the rocking prayer. All right, now gently anchor your pubic bone down to the floor. Lift the thighs up and we Lift the spine, lift the thighs, extend the legs up and come down again. In breath, lifting. Make sure you point your feet, straighten the legs and come down. Two more. In breath, articulate up, hips up. Thighs up, that is, and hip stays down, legs up and down. All right, last one. And pubic bone down, back up, thigh up, knee straighten, point the feet, lifting, and come down. Release the legs, forearm to the side of the shoulders, push off, rest position for a moment. Catch your breath, or more like it, more like catch my breath. <laughs> In breath, exhale, one more. All right, and then roll yourself up, and let's go to a quadruped position here. So we're going to do a reverse front support. We have quadruped, align the wrist and the shoulder, knee, center of the hip, then tuck the toes under. Before we lift up, we gotta lift this abdominal. So let's go ahead, pick up the abdominal, kind of flattening the lower spine, lift the knees. Gaze is down to the floor. Extend the right leg out, bring it in. Left up, bring it in. Right up, bring it in. Left up, bring it in. Right up, left. Two more sets. Gaze is down, neck is long. Last set. Last one. Bring it in. Walk your feet 
to your hands. One, two, three, four. Lower the heels down and bring your torso, your body close to your thigh. Drop the head down. Take an inhale. Make sure your feet are parallel position. Exhale, let's roll up. Roll up. And lifting tall. And use your breath to stretch up to the sky. Exhale, we roll down again. And just observe how is your spine feeling now compared to the beginning of the class. Send yourself gratitude for completing the class here today with me on a mat. Exhale, we roll up and make sure you come back to your practice daily. No matter how long it is, just present yourself on a mat for yourself and just for yourself. Stay nice and tall. Exhale, let's do one long breath in and out. And my friend, you are done. That was one sweaty class, at least for me. I'm sweaty and I'm trying to catch my breath. So thank you and well done for completing the athletic intermediate class. Keep your practice going, stay hydrated today. And I wanna see you back on the mat tomorrow for another class. All right, today, for today, have a great day and take care. Well done on completing this class, your star. I'm Mira, and I'm here to help you to love, look, and feel your absolute best through Pilates. If you enjoyed this video, you will love my free six-day intermediate challenge. Click the first link in the comments and join us in getting fit, strong, and feel energized with a calendar of new intermediate Pilates videos. This six-day challenge is taken from my 28 days intermediate Pilates program. If you would like to join the full 28 days, you'll find a link to my Flow With Mirror online membership in the description. See you in the next class.